Okay, so let's go ahead and talk about the principles of ANOVA testing. So let's get that up here real quick. And ANOVA, it's actually an acronym. It stands for analysis, analysis of variance. So the AN really comes right there. Excuse me. Let me erase it out, make it a little cleaner. There we go. Analysis of variance. So AN, O, VA. Analysis of variance. All right. So what does analysis of variance or ANOVA lets us do? ANOVA, this lets us compare multiple groups simultaneously. Okay, so previously, you know, we've done like one sample testing where we just tested one sample against a theorized value. Then when we got to a two sample hypothesis testing, we started testing two things against one another, whether they be proportions or means. Um, and the means we really were just able to do two at a time. But what happens, let's say we're a pharmaceutical company and we would like to, um, to basically test three things against each other at the same time. Like we have a placebo group, we have a treatment group, and then we have a competitor's brand that we're trying to compare against. We could take the time and actually do like three tests, but that's kind of a waste of time. We could actually do this comparing them all together at the same time with ANOVA. So ANOVA lets us take numerical data and group it by some categorical variable. And the categorical variable uh, will, it's basically how we're going to try to see is like, are these groups different at all? And so that's basically like our backbone of ANOVA.